Yep. Good translation. But they'll still use the word suicide. In fact, there's a card called suicide in that game that I didn't get until after I beat the game. Or, yeah, after I beat the game, uh, I got the card called suicide. It's the ultimate move of Vegeta. I mm -hmm. think in the North American version, it was called, like, um... It was called whatever it was called in the show when Vegeta did the thing where he blew himself up to kill Majin Buu, and it didn't work. Oh, his, like, his atonement blast? Yes. It was called, like, atonement blast or something, or a dot blast, because the, the character limit. But, um... In, in the in the European version, which is the one that I had on cartridge as a kid, yeah, I still have it, and the one I LP'd, um, because of the really weird censorship, it says suicide for some reason. <laughs> which I say the word suicide is would be a lot more damaging to a kid than killed or died, which I don't think this would be at all damaging to a kid. Especially considering kids nowadays pick Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, so I don't have any pro when I have kids, I have no problem with them playing Grand Theft Auto. The only problem I would have is if they're so fucking insane that they can't tell the difference between reality and video games, in which they've got other problems to take care of. Mm hmm Die! Okay, so I think it's five blasts will kill one. Yep. Okay. Keep that in mind. Five blasts is enough to kill one. Man, these golden capsules are everywhere. I want to point something out to you. How long do you think we've been playing this game, just grand total of the whole LP? I have no idea. I think it's been something like three hours, because it feels like an eternity. You know, this game has already gone, gone on uh, probably about twice as long as the entire first game took. And oh, we haven't yeah. even met Cell. For sure. Yeah, the we first game was six Android episodes. 17 and 18. Yeah, we haven't even met 17 and 18 yet. We've met two of the androids. One's dead. I think we've pretty much got their number. Just what? because of the energy blasts and because Vegeta's got really high power. But what about Android 8? Oh, uh, yeah, Android 8. That was from Muscle Tower. Aider. Yep. Now do you remember it? I don't remember Muscle Tower, but I do remember uh, Aider. Well, you remember where they found him, right? In the Winter Tower? Yeah. That's Muscle Tower. That's Muscle Tower? Yeah. Okay. That makes Die, sense. Die, bug droids. Where are the fucking generators? <laughs> I don't know. Tell me, robot. I don't yeah. want to. <laughs> I don't robots. want to. Throw us away card. <laughs> Explodes. <laughs> what the hell is this? Giant steaming rock. It's weird. I seem to remember this area. I think there's a dinosaur's nest up here. Nope. I was thinking of a different area. But these are weak. They're old school tiger bandits. They're one punch enemies. Yeah. Those guys used to be a threat to level one Gohan. Why would they combo them in an area with these guys? I don't know. It doesn't really make any sense. Are there many passer buyers around here for Tiger Bandits to uh, mug? No, but there's a golden capsule. Jesus Christ, these things are everywhere. I thought they're supposed to be rare. Oh, I hit a wall. <laughs> Fuck. This is the one I was thinking of. My god. Is it gonna so, try to hurt you? This is the most terrifying looking dinosaur you've ever seen in your life. <laughs> yeah, totally. Doesn't it look like a giant snake? It does, actually. But I guess I'm gonna steal your eggs. I'm feeling merciful today. I'll give you a minute to move your nest because I'm about to blow up this generator. Talks. It's actually playing the Vegeta theme. I love that, like the classic Vegeta theme. Oh, that's a good thing. Uh, there's dialogue bits like this where uh -huh. what you say and what music plays depends on what character you are. <laughs> you can do the Bront the Brontosaurus. I wouldn't even know how to do this. This is our home! You're heartless! You try my patience, creature. The fact of the, the, fact of the matter is that uh, this generator needs to be destroyed. And whether or not uh, you want to be here when it happens is up to you. I won't move. Very well then. I'll give you until the count of three. One. Two. 
three. <sighs> Having a son is making me soft. All right, here's what I propose. I'll help you move the eggs to a new location. It would be wise if you accepted my offer. You know, you don't have to be so rude. I was planning on moving to the bottom of this mountain anyway. I will be... I will start building a new nest on the, the heat vent. As long as you help me move my eggs. Just place them on the cracks for now. And please try not to break them. Vegeta would have so just shot the generator and had the whole thing explode. Man, she moved fast. Why didn't she take the eggs with her? Why don't you just fly them down the mountain? Why don't I just move them slightly and then punch all these? Because I can't attack when I'm holding an egg. So you're defenseless. Yeah, I remember this part being brutal. <sighs> hey, look, it reformed. What? I thought it was going to be like totally Vegeta. You could just go get punched once and they could break and then it wouldn't matter. Fuck. I guess there's a specific way you have to walk. We're in for the long haul, folks. Fuck! A <laughs> tiger bandit hit you, and it broke the egg. I hate how power leveling would not even help you in this situation, you know? Mm-hmm. It's all about just running. And I can't go Super Saiyan during this, I don't believe. Nope. You think that being a Super Saiyan, like, or being Vegeta, you could just not, like, get Can I just fly? Or yeah, say fuck you and not do it. Vegeta can fly, or he can just shoot the eggs with his superpowers. I have an idea. Worked. <laughs> you dick! Oh, come on! You were Super Saiyan. Now you can't transform back for a while. Nope. Gives my energy time to recharge at least. <laughs> this is totally how the show went. Oh my god. I've got to do this three times. I have a feeling after you do it the first time, it'll be a lot easier. Oh! Fucking, oh. fucking robots and tiger bandits. Fuck! I'm gonna have Big Bang attack ready for the next time they gang up on me. As soon as they break my egg, I'm blowing them up. Follow the leader. Follow the leader. Follow the... <laughs> it took three... Well, I didn't charge them all, to be fair. This is so fucking stupid. Oh. Oh, 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 fuck. This is gonna be like a full episode. <gasps> Dodge! Oh, you asshole, I hate you. <laughs> you knew it was coming. No! <laughs> I can't even come through here and kill them ahead of time because they respawn as soon as they come here. It's so stupid. This quest is so stupid. Vegeta's stupid. You can't, uh, oh. you can't argue with me, because he's being stupid right now. He is. He's being so stupid. <laughs> this is totally like a Goku thing to do. Yeah. So it's not a Vegeta thing. No! Oh. <laughs> Boom! If you charge it, it does more damage? Yeah. I didn't know that. I charged it for like a half second, and it did a hundred more damage. I want you to learn how to do Final Flash. I do believe that's a move for Vegeta in this game. I only aggroed one of them that time. It's too bad that you don't get the GT moves, because then you could learn how to do Final Shine. Times one billion! Whoa! Final Shine was like just a move for Vegeta to learn. It's like the exact same as Final Flash. Final Shine KO Ken Super Saiyan 8 times 8 billion. Whoa! This makes the show better! Whoa! I fucking hate GT. 
What what about the tournament where they fought PyCon and Goku used the Super Kaioken? If he knew how to do that, why didn't uh, he fucking do it before? No, don't, don't get me wrong, I had problems with Zed too. I had problems with the whole Boo saga. But GT was just fucking stupid. Super Kaioken! It's like, what the fuck, why don't you do this before? You could easily beat in Cell if you just did that. I bet you there's at least one person who's gonna be commenting on this and being like, You're so stupid, there's this easy way around it, and it's like, well, shut up, we didn't think of that. <laughs> I bet you there's some really simple tactic to this that I'm not thinking of. Like... THIS?! Oh. <laughs> They're gonna be like, you just fucking put down the egg and then pick it up again. It's like, you can't do that! And you try it, it's like, fuck. <laughs> I have an idea. BIG BANG ATTACK! Oh, but that doesn't kill the egg. But a punch from a tiger bite it does. <laughs> uh, fuck. That was the point the farthest we've gotten. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Suicide Kamikaze run with Vegeta. The farthest we got. <laughs> How far do we have to get? Oh my god, we have to go to another platform. <laughs> Vegeta's dead. You have died. <laughs> You have died. No, 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 no. Don't even give a shit. Use the Dragon Balls to resurrect me, you idiots. <laughs> Use the Dragon Balls to relocate these eggs. <laughs> Damn it. That was, such the, that was the greatest thing about GT's plot. You use the wishes which stored negative energy in the Dragon Balls. The fuck? Balls are full. Energy. Don't you think the dragon would have been like, "Hey guys, slow down with your witch wi with your wishes." Yeah, you think he'd bring this up? Yeah, the the fact that it's dangerous and could destroy all of the world. Like the tiger bandit on the left. <laughs> I got you. I got you, Goku. Goku. <laughs> the other you games that you could do, Goku to Piccolo. <laughs> like, I would say I'm not Piccolo. You're not allowed to call me Goku unless I pick one up. Oh! You can do it, Goku! The sprinting is not very good in this game. You fucking assholes. <laughs> you got cornered by robots. You know what? You know what you should do while I'm doing this? Go to Game Facts. See Beat. if someone has a strategy for this, please. Beat all of Diablo 2. <laughs> what? Beat all of Diablo 2 while you're doing this. Probably could. Go, um, uh, go on Game Facts for me. Legacy of Goku 2. And just control F and look for the word FUCK! <laughs> and you'll find this section. Uh, I think it's called Northern Wastelands. God damn it! Did you see that? No, I'm looking up the stupid I'm going thing. halfway down the ramp and the Tiger Bandit was standing on it. You cheap motherfucker. Um, we're at the northern mountains, right? Mm -hmm. Or northern wasteland, it's one of the two. No, we're at the northern mountains. Just, you know what, search for the word egg. No, I'm at the northern mountains already. Battle Dr. Giro! We've done that already. Battle, I think, 18. No, I, the... I fought him twice, and this is before 18. And kill the egg bots to the exit to the left. Egg bots, Dr. Shro fight, take him. Kill all the blue tiger bandits. We haven't seen blue tiger bandits. I think he went to the left, I went to the right. <gasps> you, did go to the, you did go to the right. Um, yeah. uh, you had to go both ways regardless. This is the best episode ever, and I'm not cutting because I want you guys to see how all Turn this Super game Saiyan, is. pick up an egg, and run down. Into the next screen. That's all he says? Yeah. Does he say anything after that? Wait until the enemy is off screen, then run to the bottom and wait until the egg the egg bots and the tiger bandit next to them are heading up and off the screen. That's all you have to do? For the ne for for the most part, and skim along the bottom. Head down and skim along the wall, avoiding the enemies, and you're home free. Repeat this two more times, destroy the generator, and head, head all the way back to the force field. That's all it says. Okay, I'm trying it. I don't have a whole lot of energy, though. 
Oh! Just skim along the bottom. That's what I did. Keep on the bottom. Away from the tiger. But the tiger bandit was at the fucking bottom. <laughs> I don't know. So does that game packs? I literally have to restart it now every single time just because I don't have the energy. Oh, and I forgot to go Super Saiyan this time, so let's see if I can just figure it out. I fucking hate this part. This part is fucking stupid as hell. <laughs> Find a new guide, cause that's... That can't be the only way. <laughs> Legacy? Of Goku two eggs. <laughs> Look, it's the egg part. How do I move the dinosaur eggs? Let's do that. Fucker, you see that part he talks about when they're at the top? Yeah. There's a tiger band at the bottom. <laughs> How do you move the dinosaur eggs? By eating lot by by eating lots and lots of chickens. <laughs> That's the first answer that came up. When the two robots go down, and even the t and even the tiger run to the right and hide in the edge of the cliff. Whether wow. the tiger comes up, run to the left and down. The tiger doesn't punch and escape the two tigers by tapping twice and running fast and going. When you go even down, your comp doesn't it. I don't know. That doesn't even make sense. It's like a bunch of words. God damn it! Well, that one works. That one sounds like it would work better. No, but you see, you hit hide in the right side of the cliff, and they automatically see you. What is this shit? It sounds more legit than the other fucking one. <laughs> yeah, but they can see you by standing in that cliff. You just get cornered. See, they're going down. I go into the cliff. They see you. See, what it said is that the tiger brand doesn't punch you, but it doesn't make no sense. That makes no sense. Cause he just did. Yeah, cause he's punched you twice. First, go down diagonally, not too close to the robots, nor too close to the tiger. On the left, FYI, the tiger do the tigers do punch, so avoid the punch. So avoid the one on the left. Stay in the middle. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, stay at the Dude, bottom. Oh my god! Across. There. I did. I did a tactic that was completely my own and not either of those shitheads' tactics. And then it automatically does this part. Was it run diagonally? I walked. I just waited until they all went up. Cause there's actually a point where they all go up. Blah blah blah. Yeah, I don't want to read that cause it's stupid shit. Okay, well, if it works, just keep doing it. So those shitheads were all wrong, that's great. <laughs> Game facts. God damn it. Quality website. Yeah. I don't know, I usually find good guides on there. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Now, you don't go up here. You gotta keep waiting. And you gotta wait goddamn forever, too. Yeah. Oh, you see? Sometimes. Sometimes the bandit's there and sometimes he's not. I don't get it. Turn into a Super Saiyan, you'd run even faster. Yeah, but then I don't have energy by the time I've waited to, to, till that point. True. That's difficult. Yes. Yes, it is. <clears throat> you know what? There. <laughs> God! <laughs> the turbo, he turned backwards and punched you in the face. <laughs> Uh, so I have to turbo just for this thing to go get over with faster. Uh, you see? You almost made it though. No, I didn't at all. He was right there. Yeah, but if he didn't turn around right away. But they always turn around right away. That's true. They turn away around right away instantly. <laughs> this game's fucking cheap. It is. <laughs> Yeah, that was a good choice to hang back. Oh my god. Why does that other one walk faster? 
I don't know. There. That's when you have to run. That's what I did before. So they were both wrong, because one guy has to be walking down, not up. <laughs> oh my god. I think I'm going to have a whole episode of this. Yay! Be my Maybe favorite. two. That'll be my favorite episodes. Yeah. I am almost a teetering on saying this game is worse than the first one because of stupid fucking fetch quests like this. No, no. No. The first one. You had to plant for using the first one. 